And we're back. We're Hello, the Hello, everyone. Is that more spy in your thigh? <laughs> I want some thigh hunter is what I am. Oh, throw it. I'm screwed. I'm screwed. Jesus Christ. Tap dancing I, I, saw, I saw the grenade and I wasn't able Do to. Do you see the light? I see the light. Jesus H. Tap dancing Christ. Yeah. <laughs> I, love that I think movie. I got him. Yeah. yeah, I did with my grenade. Oh, you're gonna laugh at the video I'm gonna edit for Corp Party today. I need to record more um, tomorrow, but like, I broke the game essentially. <laughs> yeah. Because uh, every chapter in Corpse Party ends with you making a, a simple decision, and all but one of your decisions will lead to death. And I chose the wrong thing, and my decision led to death. And essentially, uh, as soon as I tried to load the like. As soon as I died, like my entire party died, then the game just was all stuck on a loading screen for about two minutes. You know? Hello. Hello. Sorry, I wanted to say that. I just got a soundboard of myself. Would you buy a, a Nate soundboard, Vince? Have some, like, uh, Nate sound effects going on? <laughs> That'd be so funny. You know? Like, people have, like, the applause sound effects and all that other fun stuff. Yeah, exactly. That'd be funny. Okay, it's all right here. It's going to be a short episode for my next corpse party just because it crashed. I don't remember where, how we did this. Do you remember how we did this? Crap. Oh, this fucking puzzle. Oh, my God. It set us back a little bit. Crap. Yeah, because we died yeah. the last uh, episode. Yeah, we position the third one so that it's pretty much next to the wall. No, not that's the first one. This is the Shit. first one. Okay. And I have it hit the second one. So guys, I was showing Vince a clip of the Dig and Rampa anime because I'm trying to get because I know he likes Dig and Rampa and I've been talking about it a lot. Um, but I've been trying to get him to watch the anime, which isn't as good as the games, but it's still good, and it's really funny. But yeah, there's one creepy clip in it when oh, she's no. Teacher Junko, so she has her glasses, and she literally kicks Mikan down, throws her glasses, her glasses land on Mikan's butt. And then she stomps her glasses into Makan's butt, and she's super into it. There we go. It's really weird. But you know Makan's a masochist. So, you know. Oh, fuck. It's all good. There we go, we'll render that. And I can't render any Resident Evil because we haven't recorded it yet. But we will soon, damn it. Oh, shit. I got hurt. Yeah, do not get lasered either. Do not, for the love of God, get lasered. Run away! Run away! Run, run away! away. <laughs> I should have played that on October because that's on uh, Rock Band Four. Yeah, I'm drunk. Heal. Wait to heal. Look. See your bars. There yeah. you go. So as soon as your bar dithers, that means you're hurt, but it'll eventually come back. And if it's I, completely I can't. gone, then I can't get through that. You can't shoot. Are you stuck? You have to get through it somehow. Okay, cool. Oh, there alternate path. There you go. Alternate path. Alternate your path, dog. Oh, I think my phone's buzzing. Does anyone care about me on the internet? Nope. It's just my friend Doe texting me. Ooh, there we go. Health. Give me that health. Oh, there we go. Good love, Caps Lock. Do, 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 do. <laughs> no, 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 no. There we go. How that send. So, tomorrow I have another 10 to 4 shift. Yeah. And then as soon as I get home, I'm recording Corpse Party. So, I'm doing my week of content for Corpse Party. And then uh, on Wednesday, I'm waking up super early, playing up to Class Trial 1 of Dangan Rampa 3, and uh, a little bit of Rocktober. And then Yeti and I are going to get sushi. Ooh, sushi. I love sushi. Love sushi. We cycle between three sushi joints, you know? So we're gonna go to Toru Sushi again, which is great. I love Toru Sushi. Like, I need to exactly know what I got. I'm not gonna get the bento box like I did last time. The bento box I got was delicious, though. Have you ever got a bento? Huh. A bento box is supposed to be something that you get for like a lunchtime thing. So it'd be something traditional and like Japanese, like businessmen and schoolboys to like have the like a, a box like a like pretty much a freaking Tupperware thing that's separated. Like, by little trays, and then you have, like, a little scoop of rice. Uh, four rolls of sushi. And then in another tray, you have, like, something fried, so, like, tempura. Yeah. And then in another tray, you have, you know, this. So 
that's what a bento box is. So I that, usually always get eel. Eel is like one of my main go to. Eel is delicious. Uh, unfortunately for the bentos, you only have three options, and that is crab, and you get like hardly any um, cucumber rolls or spicy tuna. So spicy tuna is where it's at. You get four of them, and mmm, tasty. Some. Except this time I'm going to get their house rolls, so I'm going to do like two or three plates of house rolls, and then something fried, so I'm going to spend like 20 bucks on sushi. <laughs> That's fine. I don't know, I always seem to spend like 50 bucks. Well, yeah, if you're going ham on the sushi. Oh my god. What are you supposed to do? Just drop that missile on something? I'm not sure. That is a good I'm just kind of going through the motions Ooh, right you're now. you're supposed to move just... it all the way to that pedestal? Ooh, no. Oh, yeah. Blam. Or not. What? No, that uh, was, that was what you were supposed to yeah, do. Nice. It blew this door open for me. Nice. Radical. Wow. Dude, <laughs> wow. He's the best freaking sergeant I've ever seen. He just face planted there. That was beautiful. Hey, look, he's doing the same thing. He's just chilling. Nice. Oh, he also didn't make it. I figure I'll take him out just to take it's him stone, out. Stone Luigi. You didn't make it. Oh man, I like how the rock kind of glitched under that door right yeah, there. Yeah, I thought it was going to duck, great. but... That would have been fun. He should have ducked. Should have ducked. Oh! Bleep, I am a robot. They throw grenades at me before I'm even ready. Bleep, grenade avoiding procedure activated. Bleep. Take throw my grenade. <laughs> yeah. Take my grenade, bitch. How's my period blood taste, bitch? I'm not going to reference weird things anymore. There is a animator... <laughs> on the internet called Hot Diggity Demon. He's really talented. But how he got famous was actually brony parody vids. And I'm ashamed to say that I've watched a few. And one of them called Shed.Move. Don't watch it. But, like, the entire thing is a Carrie parody. You yeah. know what I'm talking about? No. Have you seen the horror movie Carrie? Yes. Okay. You know the scene when they're at prom and they dump pig blood on her? Yes. Yeah. Okay, it's tweaked like that. So, like, one of the My Little Ponies forgot the name because I don't care and I'm not a brony. Uh, is on stage, and then they dump blood, but in a deep man's voice, he's like, how's my period blood taste, bitch? And for some reason I remember that, because it's been YouTube pooped super hard, because it's so creepy and stupid. Yeah. But that entire thing is creepy and stupid. Well, I mean, normal carry is kind of creepy, but... I don't know, it wasn't all that it? creepy, it was just... It was weird. Sort of like... I don't know, just, it was a revenge movie. That's yeah. That's all it really was. True. Woo! Now we're in the Halo rooms. Hooray! I love the Halo rooms, Vince. They're pretty dope. He's running. He's running around out the uh, I didn't. I don't think he made it. No, he's I think that automated... Uh... Oh, yeah. The go is still getting shot. Nope, now they know that we're here. Oh, dear. I want to have more car Find missions. I really like the car missions. Which I know they were trying to, like, emphasize that this is... Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, shit. Wow. So we've got to find a way to get past them because there's two of them in the room. There's one right when you walk in. And one of the one across the room. And you got to find a way to get... I want you to show me the way And of course all these guys respawn. Yeah, great. You know what one of the best songs is that I'm playing on Rocktober a lot later? Do you know the song In Agata De Vida? It doesn't sound Agata De Vida, honey. Don't you know that I love you? It is the second longest song uh, I like I've ever heard. It's 18 minutes long. You know? Because they probably like were super high when they wrote it, and they're like, you know what'd be good? An eight-minute drum solo. <laughs> and then they did Backbreaker him or something. You know, keep punching him works too. He's it's dead. a good song though. Is there you know? some health somewhere? I hope. What, what, does health, what does health look like in this again? It's a little, like, red box on the wall. Don't punch the fire extinguisher. But That's a bad to. idea. But I want to punch the fire extinguisher, Dad. Because... Now, Jimmy, have you have you eaten all your all your vegetables? Yeah, uh, yeah I've eaten all my vegetables. Dude, the gun is going ham. Like, I don't think you can hurt him if his shield's up. Like, if he's not shooting, you can't shoot him. You know? You know what I mean? Yeah. Because it looks like his shield clasps over him. Go to the top floor see if anything's up here like health or something. Oh, uh, just to, you see the arrow button? It's telling me to kind of go this way, so... I hope there is weapons up here. 
I'll be less sleepy when we record. No. The problem is, we have to do the train escape sequence again. Do off we? Off camera, yeah. But literally, we'll do that off camera, and then as soon as um, we get to the mansion again, then we'll start recording, and then it'll all be fresh. And we only need to do four episodes, since we're going to record more on uh, Thursday. You know? Think you can shoot those down? But, oh, there's three guns! Yeah, there's, there's no There's three way. guns, Vince. Oh, you're bone. Oh, I can't. That, what? Like, it pretty much, like, saved you into a corner, essentially. I really hope that it didn't. Try to do it again. Try to go, like, okay, kill the dudes without taking any damage or, like, minimal damage. And then go to that. There's a grenade, like, yeah. I was going to be like, there's a grenade next to you, Vince. But it doesn't matter. And you're not safe anywhere. That's the problem, you know? Well, I don't know why it respawned these, respawned these guys. Yeah. Because that, I mean, I'm already dead. Yeah, you got two shits of health. If only you got health like Blood Rain did by suplexing people. Yeah, I'm not gonna make it. Yeah. In fact, I'm just gonna tank this one because. No, you can try. Try your damnedest. Oh, you're getting punched. Oh Whoa! shit! <laughs> Dude, do you have any epic music you can play? Can I can I tell you can I do, can I please tell you to do future events really quick? Yeah, I do future events. Future events. I want to see that again in slow mo with cool music in the background. All right. Can you do that. If not, you can send me the clip and I can try to slow mo it. Nice. That was fucking precision. Nice. You got hurt by his homeboy's grenade. So what you do, what do you do in at least the premium version of Sony Movie Studio is if you right click it and go to properties, you can go playback rate. You know. Yeah. And then you have to do that separately for uh, audio and video, but you set it to 50% playback rate. And then you sh and then for your video, you just take the timeline and then multiply it by two. You know, so if it says it's two minutes and one second, then you make it four minutes and two seconds, you know? And then if you do both those things, then you have a funny slow-mo clip. Okay, yeah. so you can't Pretty kill Pretty much it. you have to take a few shots, let your health heal, let your health come back, let your health come back, let your health come back. Okay, now you can go in again. You can't take it down. Wow. Good so... lord. Let yourself heal though. Oh look! Wow! That's what they look like. Mm, tasty. Nice. Or maybe you're just supposed to run, or do you think running will fuck you up? Okay, so that's... No, that's not what I <laughs> wanted to do! <laughs> the rock just had an extra grenade no he wanted sneak. to waste. Okay, I'm gonna do the... The flippy doos? Yeah, that's what I want. I want the... Uh, the roll. It's punch, okay. The punch. Falcon! So I'm punch. just gonna have to like book it, is what I'm guessing. Is like Falcon kick. Yes! Nice. Keep dodging. Keep diving. You can dive in. You can take some hits. You can take some hits. Oh, the door's locked. That one's not. That one's not. Oh, dear. Holy crap. You, you let yourself heal, though. Try to avoid bullets. Let yourself heal. Let yourself heal. You need to heal, Vince. I know spy hunters are inherently hard, but you really need to heal, like, desperately. I can't. I don't know how. Keep diving. Keep diving and don't get shot. No. Okay, so now I at least know that I can make it through that room. How long are your Spy Hunter episodes anyway? About 15. Okay. Making sure. We haven't recorded Spy Hunter in about two, three weeks, ladies and gentlemen, so I honestly forgot. Ow, my ass. And my spine. I should do the. I should do the thing that I taught you to do, okay. you know, like this, when you lay on the ground and you're like. You know? I really should do that. I don't know if there's any room in your house for me to do that. Aww. Okay, that, I, I went down a hallway. I didn't know it was a dead end. I like when you exploded, though. That was fun. <laughs> yeah, that was a good... Yeah, that was really funny. Good cut. Yes, it was. I hope you can future events that. If not, just have something on the screen that's like, I'm sorry, I can't future events that. Hard future events or something. Because my future nates take a little bit of effort. I've only done one future events joke this entire Let's Play. You can't blame me, you know? Can you, how do you pick up bitches? Pick them up. Oh yeah, there you go. There you go. Fuck hand to hand. Grenade to hand. You missed. Dive through the other door. Oh, oh, come on. Vince, I told you to dive through the door because he had one health. I'm sorry. Do one more attempt. Do okay. one more attempt this episode and then and then more death on the next part. What will happen? Well, my computer is warm. It's all that good Nate footage. Yeah, I know. All that hot goodness. 
Oh man, you got laid the fuck out. Wow, come on, Dwayne. The problem wow, nice. The problem is everyone's double armored. You can't be hand to hand fighting like Blood Rain. Like it's too difficult to just be hand to hand fighting. You have to like if they're gonna be sneaky and use guns, you gotta use guns. There you go. He knocked the gun out of my hand, so. Yeah. Oh, that's a good guy. Yep. We did it. <laughs> Hooray! I shot my friend. Ooh, pick up that axe. Pick up the axe. Ooh. You can't. I can't. Damn it. Yay. Oh, there we go. Just hitting the wrong button. Yep. Dwayne Johnson with an axe, everybody. Decker, nice work. You secured three of our labs, but there's nice. four to go. I'm four running. To go. You want to do and on the next installment? The next installment. Pick up the health. Cool. All right. On the next installment of Spy Hunter: No More to Run, we are going to continue with this surprise attack in this underwater facility, and we are going to ask them a question on the next <laughs> adventure in Spy Hunter. Later, no dudes. No.